What's going on guys? Logan JYA here. Here with Prisco YGO oh. commentating my homie. Oh god, yes, Felix here top aided the goofy gauntlet, the biggest IRL Yu-Gi-Oh! event since the start of the pandemic. And my brother, what did you play today? Uh I played uh Tri Brigade Zoo or how I call them, uh the Zoo Tribe. Oh god, yes, I love it. <laughs> Zoo Tribe, um I went X11. Um Last round, I ended up drawing, uh, which wasn't bad, you know, like it is what it is, we drew. Um, but during the event, the deck ran smoothly, I'm happy with my uh, hand trap lineup, like, you're gonna see it's kind of like different, it, it's kind of like standard, but the hand trap lineup is different, so it's like, that's where uh, it, it helped me like, overachieve, basically. Gotcha, so let's get into the list. Yes sir, so obviously, uh, staple. I play one whip tail, one Sodiaco Topo Stoko, oh, aka God. Rat Tear, uh, and Ram Ram. Oh, this is yeah. basic um, zoo package. It's like I either Zeus you or I'm gonna make my fairy dish, special summon one from the hand and go crazy. And then I end up Appalooza most of the time, like Appalooza, Tear as uh, Double Dragon Lord. Mm -hmm. Just off a of, uh, Rat Tear. Jesus, alright. Oh man. Rat Tear. Uh, so this is hand trap for Ram. Cool, cool. For uh, my. The tribe, I played two Keras. Oh, I'm sorry, two Keras, mm -hmm. three Nerval, gotcha, three Kit, and my main man Beater. Oh God, that's what I yes. call him all day, Beater. <laughs> I mean, he's a 2K Beater when you got tanky on him. Oh yeah, he's I'll, chunky, bro. He's yeah. swinging over people. Um, this this deck reminds me of Eldritch. Mm -hmm. So it's like you have to know when to like dump and send and stuff. Um, obviously, uh, Dumper, Fractal, um, I call him the loader. <laughs> this deck is so dangerous because of one card combo. Mm -hmm. I go Fractal, Kit, Nerval, um, Keras, that's three monsters already, that's Double Dragon Lord. Um, so that's pretty simple, uh, you know, staple. My hand trap lineup. This right. is where we got the I'm spice, really right? Proud, yep. So ghost, but two ghost belt. I was playing three, but I I took out the third one for what did I take out the third one? I took out the third oh for a call by. Right. I took okay. out the third one for the call by. Also, um, I don't want to see multiple of these. Um, like a dragon link, you hit world legacy, blue sector, striker dragon. There's so many things in, in Dragon Link it hits. There's a reason I played this card uh, over Nib or Drone. This hits Prank, prank Kids. Prank Kids is a really hard matchup for this deck because if you don't open two hand traps and you don't know exactly where to hit them, Prank Kids keeps steep rolling. Which was my only loss to Joe Boldly. Shout mm. out to Boldly. Um, it was literally Prank Kids. Three. See? Amo de la Calavera. Look at this guy. All right, all right, all right. Tell us the logic behind this and how good okay. it was. Mirror right. match, Skullmeister, Negate, Kit, Nerval, Frank. Um, Dragon Link, Chaos Space, um, Tiding to, uh, whatchamacallit, the Special Summon, Cypher to get back Levy. Mm -hmm. It stops like, and it's not once per turn, so it stops a lot of stuff. Um, Prank Kit. Yeah. Stops the Prank Kit. So like during the round, I played. So my matchups were two Dragon Links, two Dinos. No, actually three Dragon Links, two Dinos, two Prankids. I only lost to one of the Prankids. Mm -hmm. Against a Dragon Link player, he had one card in hand and his graveyard loaded. He goes Tiding and standby. I go Skullmeister. He goes okay. Mage, Cypher, to get back Levy, I go Skullmeister. Next turn, I draw, Desire, Summon Kara, bomb, bomb. Got gotcha. you. <laughs> um, also, in a case that your opponent is low on life, because a lot of people are playing like Imperial Order or Strike or Judgment now, 17, my guy. Yeah, he's a picky Pretty too. Pretty and then obviously, you know, I gotta play the babies. Yeah, no explanation either. Yeah, it's no sad. explanation. It hits every deck. Mm -hmm. It hits every deck. So, pick hand trap lineup. What's our total? Uh, eight. So I played right. eight hand traps. Close I play. Sweet spot. Yeah. Yeah. I play. I play forty one, and I play two desires, which mm -hmm. you'll see a little bit down the line. Um, also, everything they all thin out the deck. Right. Right. So right. it's like on my turn I do this. If I draw revolt on your turn, I'm doing the same thing. I'm dumping, adding like this deck. 
it's just, it's, it's I said it earlier um, for the guys that were watching the live stream. I think this deck, as of right now, before the balance, can out resource Dragon Link. I'm really? not even gonna lie. Like I, I I'm like. I'll stand by it like 98% of the time. It can out uh, resource Dragon Link. The traps mm -hmm. are a little tricky. Also, when you see this Jorge, my brother, shout out to him because he made me understand uh, why Skullmeister is really is really good in this format. He made me understand. So shout out to Jorge. Jorge, you're the my man. Brother, yeah. <laughs> um, traps, Imperial, playing Pharaoh's Servant, uh, Imperial. You got Alps. it. Because every game three, uh, I would see this going first. Talent! Oh my goodness. <laughs> like, they'll go against a dino player. He had four spells. One uh, Obi Raptor. He goes Fossil Dick. I go Imperial Order. He goes, okay, uh, uh, Obi Raptor. Search Miss. Mm -hmm. Discard Miss. I go, uh, what's his name? Doom Eagle. Have Star. Yep, whatever. yep, yep, yep. Oh, chain. Since so you discard, it discards for calls, put the miscellaneous back. Mm -hmm. That's it. That, you're, you're done. Two Torrentials. I was debating playing um, Dino Miscus, but Torrential is so freaking good. Like against a Dragon Link player, I dried in his blue sector. Mm -hmm. He summoned, normal summon, I bounced him back with double dragon. He had the quick launch, last card in hand. Quick launch, okay, TT. Now my graveyard is full. Like, I have, my, I have three in my graveyard, and next turn I'm just going back in. Best trap in, in the deck. Yeah, I agree. Ice Dragon's Prison. Remember picking these up when they were two dollars. Ooh, yep. big plus. Yeah. <laughs> Super plus. Shout out to Brad, my boy Brad, a uh, big guy on Dueling Book. Two strikes. Ooh, the freshies too. Yeah. Uh, I would play a third one. I don't have a third OT. <laughs> so, yeah. just, just playing two. Um, and then. Don't, card you don't even gotta say nothing about this. Best card this card the deck. The soul charge, bro. Mm -hmm. The soul charge, bro. This card. <laughs> Let me put so much amount of pressure by itself. It's not even freaking funny. Like I underestimated this card. I was playing this at two. No, nope, I understood. Nope. Yeah, when I understood the value, it went immediately to three, and I even took out the the trap trick. As you can mm. see, I don't play trap trick. Right. right. Let's speed through these spells. We got the the, the card barrage. Mm -hmm. barrage. The one called by. Yep. Yep. To uh, tough Zyres. there, whatever. Yeah, 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 dig deep, dig deep. Uh, Boldly explained to me, and I understood that this is a plus one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I was like, fuck it. Like, I'll Th play. That, that was one of the reasons why I decided to cut the prosperity in my build and put desires in because it's, it's a plus one, yeah. whereas prosperity, you're kind one of breaking one. even. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, tactics that over it. I gotta ask, how good was this? Oh it sounds God. like it was putting in work. Perform. Like, tactic, every time I would tactic my opponent to see their hand, like, I took an interruption and I just took control of the game. And then the last card, um, place of the tanky, like, not explainable. We all know what it does. Yeah. Like, yeah. It, it, it's there to, like, do stuff. Sweet. Alright, let's take it, let's take it to the extra deck and then we'll uh, finish off with the side. Yes, sir. So my extra deck, um, Gorbo. Yep. Yep. Chaka Nine. Yep. Tiger Mortar. Mm -hmm. Dryden. Zeus. Obviously the package. That's the standard, right? Yeah, yeah, standard. Um El Mirage, mm -hmm. Link One, the only Link One I play. I don't like Link Karibu in this deck. Yeah, most of the time you only play the one. Right? Yeah. Um Double Dragon Lord. This really guy's putting in work, right? This, this guy is amazing. Card Again, crazy. another card I underestimated. Fairy Jet. Mm -hmm. Um, really good, really good card, amazing. Now I got a quick. I was just yeah. gonna ask, uh, when you get Bear Bloom well, next week, are you cutting one for Bear Bloom, or what are you what are you gonna cut for the? Bear no, I'm, pre I'm I'm pretty sure cutting one of them for Bear Bloom. Playing one, yeah, because Bear Bloom is also situational. I'm not gonna dig deep into it, but it's situational, so it's like it depends like the build I decide to play. But I'm pretty sure I'm gonna cut this for. And the I think Bear it also Bloom. depends on your opening hand as yeah. well. If you're able to yeah. play or not. So. Yeah, like you most likely do regular normal plays. Mm -hmm. If Bear Bloom's gonna give you a play Plus, or like you need a um, what's the name revolt then you go for bear bloom if not if you open the revolt there's no need to go into it it locks yeah. you gotcha. um, my guy doom eagle putting so much work against mm -hmm. dino even like a dragon link i kept putting a uh, back monsters so if he topped the levy he had no monsters to vanish <laughs> it, it was it was really good um rugal self-explanatory yeah you have Shurag and this on your opponent's turn. You could special summon Bannock, yada, yada, yada. So I feel like Rugal's a little underrated. Mm -hmm. uh, I like him. Because he, he's like, he can get you cards back from your graveyard, mm -hmm. and if your opponent can't get rid of it, then it just goes back to your hand. Yeah. So you kind of just like a lot of times, resources. A lot of times that I had Torrential, I'll go 
little set your intro like make this and then when they're like I know they're at a point that they won't be able to come back from I just activate effect bring back Farragut Torrential yep, yep. So and I then you get your draw uh -huh. yeah yes, very very good mm -hmm. two sure eyes I want to up this Really? The three? I'm gonna be honest with you, I really wanna freaking up this. Yo, I, I'm feeling the same way, dude. So much work, bro. I think somebody in between the rounds, I hit him for like 1,100, uh, 11,200 damage. Like, was, like, I made access code using him as one of the materials, put four, made another one of him with fractal on field. Like, it was ridiculous. Bruh. Like, and then the beater's coming in. Yeah, like, yeah the beater. <laughs> uh, Apple, really yep. standard. Mm -hmm. um, Apple really gave me game, like, Apple. most of the Apple, time. I think Apple actually ties this deck all together. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, I mostly end Apple, uh, Keras, and Double Dragon Lord, or yeah. Apple, um, this, like, it don't matter. Like, it, it is what it is. And then Access Code. Yup. Access, whatever his name is. Amazing card. It's just push for game, bro. Like it is what it is. Like guy's amazing. Like yeah, I love him. I'm so happy I got him in Spanish. Nice. <laughs> All right. Let's clean it up with the uh, the side. We'll call it a day. Yes, sir. So my side is kind of weird, right? All right. So Let's we play see. the one red reroll. Of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sack so you the, one up. These two cards I'm about to show you were two judgments, and I took them out. Okay. Like, okay. On the card right here. <laughs> um, so red reboot. Mm -hmm. right? Yo, I heard about this. I heard about this. You're the one with the right geki. Uh, Let's so, go. No, so my boy uh, in the second round, Jose, he's uh, my, one of my teammates. He did it to somebody. Like they were in the table. I don't know where. It was like the first second round. He right geki, and everybody just started looking. We act <laughs> like we talked about it uh, coming uh, to the event, and we switched it. Like we, me, my brother, and him, we switched it in the right card here, mm -hmm. like the card right. So it put in work. Oh yeah. Dark Ruler, like, uh, there was an instance against the Dragon player, I lost the game because it was the next card I was gonna draw, but if I would've drew this instead of the one I drew for turn, um, I baited out his negate, right, Geki would've just cleaned his frill with Apple, uh, Savage, uh, Pisty. Um, really good card. Definitely will keep it like this. Mm -hmm. Three, um, Twin Twister, Wonder Reactive, um, like your opponent. You activate a spell, your opponent does Imperial Order, boom, you hit them with this. Mm -hmm. um, standby Prank Kids is my worst matchup. Um, standby Prank Kids, kiss them. Mm, okay, yep, they yep, yep, yep. Them, they think they're slick, you slicker. Hang on, let's, let, let's let that go, let's let that go. And... Alright, there we go, back to it. See? Um, three Dark Ruler no more, so Dark Ruler and this is like stupid. Yeah, that's game. Like, yeah, mm -hmm. it's stupid. Um, staple, like it's staple, yep, you yep, know, yep. Yeah, it doesn't do much. Um, two Lancia, I would want to up the three, but I don't want to take out the Red Rebel or the, or the, whatchamacallit, mm -hmm. the Red Geki. Gotcha. Um, I play Desire, so like I could like try and draw it into Desires. Mm -hmm. If not, most of the time that I'm going second, I like, like the Penza deck, like it's either Nibiru and Phantasmia or Phantasmia, Lancia, Dark Ruler. Right. So like this lets me fish. Like I did a Saruja basically earlier. Yeah, of course, like, of course. It was like stupid. Uh, so yeah, the two Phantasmi. I guess Dragon Link, this card is just it's amazing. Against Dragon Link, yeah, they go uh, they go Sears, Pist uh, LP, Striker, you go Phantasmi. Draw four. Draw four, put back three, Resolution, Nibiru, good luck. Yeah, get right. <laughs> yeah, it's like, and then Nib, um, I was playing Drow, I'm pretty sure Drow's gonna go into the deck. Yeah, with Drytron uh, coming yeah, out, yeah. Drytron. But I'm also gonna be playing Drytron, so. Me too! Hey, welcome to the club. Now, before we close out here, I wanna ask, what was what was the most impactful card in your deck, and then what was the hardest matchup? And then we're gonna close. Hardest match matchup was boldly right right yeah yeah you mentioned that you uh, mentioned that's that. my only law mm -hmm. best card in the deck i'm not gonna lie skullmeister damn not straight <laughs> skullmeister really was like he was the mvp of the day bro all right so shout out to skullmeister and felix my man congratulations on your dub brother it. keep it going any shout outs you want to get before we close uh shout out to got no gaming obviously my teammates are here shout out to my fiance that's right there mm. uh shout out to goofy gaming imperial uh gaming mm -hmm. shout out to uh, all my teammates all the people that play tested with me um the dueling dojo that's my group chat from new york uh, Matthew Navarez, um, and Sang Chung. Mm -hmm. um, shout out to my brother for telling me to play the Skullmeister. 
And shout out to everybody, bro. Good event, great event. Uh, definitely the best event in the East Coast. Best, definitely better than the PPD also. Hell yeah, brother. All right, thank you so much, man. Logan JYA and Prisco YGO. Signing out. Have a great day. Peace. Crazy, berserker, I kill it, it's murder. Go crazy, berserker.